And in light of today's centennial of Korea's provisional government, a commemorative event is being held in central Seoul to mark the occasion. For more details, let's connect to our Kim ji who's who is currently at one of the main events in Yeido for us. ji the event you're at is taking place at a significant venue and a significant time. Tell us more. Sure, I'm standing at the Yoido Park Culture Square, where the festivities are just getting started. Located near me are the rows of beautiful cherry blossoms, and the venue is at a, a military arm. is a significant place where a landing take put, took place from a military arm at Korea's provisional government, which landed at the year the country gained independence from Japan's 35-year-long colonial rule at exactly 7.19 p.m. local time in 1945. The event, which is taking place at the same location and timing, it is a dedication for the efforts made by the Korea's provisional government for their dedication to fight liberation from Japan. Now, Jian, I believe various performances and a reenactment of the independent activist efforts are scheduled. Can you tell us more about what's planned for tonight? Sure. Uh, the event starts with a performance uh, in including a torch of independence, which was ignited last month at a ceremony marking the 100th anniversary of the March 1st movement and then travel across the country for 42 days. An estimated 10,000 people are expected to uh, participate in this event, including government officials, former independence fighters and their families, as well as the general public. That's around 10 times more than last year. Other commemorative events are also taking place worldwide, in, including Shanghai and Los Angeles. That's it for me. Back to you guys. I'm reporting live from Seoul's Yoido Park Square.